All right, this one's from D. Mathis in Florida. All right. Ah, Milpini, have we done this one? Can you just double check? I think, I think I've done that exact same one. Yes. Uh, okay, hi. Uh, I'm a fan of the channel and I've seen several of your videos. Uh, I was wondering if you could review these masks I've been getting from eBay. I hope they do well because they're pretty comfortable and affordable. $25 for 20 pieces. Even if they do well, however, I'm very interested in getting Palantcom, KN95, or 3M order from watching your videos. Thanks for the efforts. DM. Also, blow are the image. Thanks for showing me the box. That's, yeah, if you can't send me the box, although folding it up would be the best. Although in this case, I'm pretty sure we have already, we bought this on Amazon and we reviewed it. We haven't done it? Oh, that's right. They did the, uh, it was a surgical. So we've done their surgical. We have not, it's like an Italian or it's like a weird, oh no, it's China. All right. Let's do it. So this is a Chinese standard for surgical masks, 1983, 2010. I don't know the specifications. And what's weird about it is there are like five different, like you can, it can be anything from like 70% filtration to like 99% filtration. But it also is claiming type 2R, which is 98% filtration. That's interesting, Milpini. Oh, good job, Eric. Proud of you on that one. All right, this is a PFE machine, uh, particulate filtration efficiency machine. We are doing the N95 test here. Interestingly, on the packaging, it claims, or on the mask, it claims type 2R, which I believe is 98% filtration using that machine we have right there. This one's a little bit more aggressive test. However, on the packaging itself, it says 0.3 micron NACL efficiency 95%. It says KN95, but it is not a KN95 because it doesn't say GB2626 test 2019. In fact, it's making a different claim, 19083, which is not a standard I'm super familiar with, but I think that's a standard for surgical masks, not KN95s. So a lot of weird stuff going on here, but we'll see. DM, what it does. These are being sold a lot on eBay. I remember hearing uh, about this. Um, so we'll see. Milpini. It's one of these things where they didn't put enough syllables in, or uh, vowels in. M-I-P-L-N-E. Mip-N-E. Can I buy a vowel? 97.75%. 97.75%. Uh, breathability of 226, which is a little high for a fresh mask. Um, I think that is below standard, although actually I'm getting tired now. It might be 115 pascals. Uh, I'm not going to hold them to that. It is not a KN95 and it's claiming to be, but it does have 97% filtration. So not the worst mask that you could get. Again, Palcom, that's your jam. If you want a Chinese mask, go Palcom. Super affordable. Like every time we've tested one, it works. Um, I don't, I like the individual packaging, but I, I don't like the thinness of this particular packaging.